to fix this problem there are two simple methods method 1 open the control panel to open it please type in the search box control panel and then click on the first search result ok now the control panel window will open here after making the view mode as category please click on network and internet in the next window click on network and sharing center now in this window you can see here uh, you, your inter name of your internet connection so please click here and then this window will open in this window please click here properties in this new window from this list please locate internet protocol version 4 ok it is here please select it and then go down and click here properties then this new window will open now please circle this option use the following DNS server address and then towards preferred DNS server please type 8888 and then towards alternative DNS server please type 8844 as shown in this video then please put check mark in this box towards validate settings upon exit and then click ok ok now close this window close this one ok now you can see the windows network diagnostics detecting the problem with your dns server please wait till this process will be completed the second method is quite simple for this please type here in the search box command prompt as you can see on the screen then please right click on the first search result and then select run as administrator then this window will open in this window first of all please enter this command ipconfig backslash flush dns you can copy this command from the description of this video below after entering this command please hit the enter key on the keyboard and now please uh, enter another command ipconfig backslash renew and then hit once again the enter key and now please enter the third command ipconfig backslash register dns you can copy this ca these commands from the description of this video below after entering the command hit the enter key ok now close this window by typing here exit and then hitting the enter key ok now you have done it now please restart your computer after restarting your problem should be fixed if still the problem exists then please turn off and then turn on your internet modem we hope this video will help you thank you for watching this video by itech tips please like this video and subscribe our channel for the latest updates Thank you.